New here tonight, if you come down with COVID-19, chances are you could end up having long-lasting health effects. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell is digging deeper into the new research out today and shares the message from one COVID survivor who is still struggling. This beast, I call it a beast because it's not even worthy of me calling it a virus. Back in March, Robert Marrero came down with COVID-19 in the hospital for 36 days on a ventilator for 19. We shared his story when he got out of the hospital in May. How does it feel to be going home? Great. But months later, the debilitating pain at times. Marrero says he has lingering effects, trembling, memory issues, fatigue. One of the biggest questions I have is, am I gonna stay like this? We don't have a full roadmap sitting there to look at and say, Here's what we'll expect now, and here's what we're going to expect in a year. Dr. Jason Wilson says they've had patients who still need oxygen and have chest pain. Health experts are still getting a grasp on the illness's long-term effects. The Mayo Clinic explained COVID-19 may affect the heart, lungs, and brain, cause mood issues and fatigue, even help form blood clots. You can also have blood clots in other places. You can have blood clots in the arteries, too. And those blood clots in the arteries show up as things like strokes. I thought cancer was going to be the, the icing on the cake, but this... Experts say a lot is unknown on how COVID-19 will affect people over time. Until that becomes clear, survivors want people to take COVID-19 seriously. It's real. It's real as the air that you breathe in. So you don't face a long road to recovery, too. In Tampa, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.